Hello kids, welcome to Kidovate. Today we are going to learn two digit story sums and subtractions. Okay, let's start. Here is the first story sum. What is the story? Sita had 56 mangoes and she sold 23 mangoes. How many mangoes are left? Here is the left keyword we are using. Means subtraction. Left is the keyword of subtraction. Okay. Here is the sentences. Now, number of mangoes Sita had. How many? 56. Right? 56. Next, how many sold? 23. Number of mangoes she sold? 23. Next, what they are asking? How many mangoes are left? Okay. Number of mangoes are left. Now, what is the symbol of subtraction minus? Okay. Here, we are writing on the top tens and ones. Always we have to do ones place first. Okay. Here, what are the ones place numbers? Six and three. Here on the top, big number is there. Okay. In that six and three, which is the biggest number? Six. That's why we are not taking borrowing. See here what we are using without borrowing. Okay. Now keep it in your mind 6, big number and open 3 fingers. Here subtraction means going backward. Means before numbers. Okay. Now 6 before what is that? 5. 5 before 4. 4 before 3. See what is 6 minus 3? 3. Now here in the tens place what are the digits? 5 and 2. Okay. Here 5 is the biggest number. Keep it in your mind 5 and open 2 fingers. Now again we are going backward. What is 5 backward number before number? 4. 4 before 3. See here, answer is 3. Now, how many mangoes are left? Sita had 33 mangoes. Okay, kids? Next. Next story sum. There were 72 balloons. 28 balloons flew away. How many balloons are left? Here also we are using keyword of left key. Left is the keyword of subtraction. Okay. Here is the sentence number of balloons. First of all, how many number of in how many balloons are there? 72. Next, how many flew away? 28. Okay, number of balloons are flew away. 28. Next, what they are asking? How many balloons are left? Okay. Number of balloons are left. We should calculate. Now, what is the symbol of subtraction? Minus. Okay. Here, we are writing on the top of the numbers, tens and ones places. Okay. Here, on the top, 2 and 8. Okay. In the ones place, what are the numbers? 2 and 8. On the top, what is the number? 2. 2 is less than 8. That's why we, we are taking from before number borrowing. Here we are taking 10 number. What is 10 plus 2? It become 12. Okay. 2 become 12. We are taking borrowing from before number 12. Cross 2 and take 12. Now we can do 12 minus 8. Okay kids. Now keep it in your mind 12 and open 8 fingers. Okay. Now we are going backward. What is 12 before? 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, and 4. What is the 12 minus 8? 
4. Here we are taking borrowing, right? That's why one number less. 7 minus 1, 6. 6 minus 2. Okay, keep it in your mind. Big number 6 and open two fingers. What is 6 before? 5. 4. What is the answer? 4. Finally, how many balloons are left? 44 balloons. Okay, kids. Next, it's a practice time. Story sum 3. Okay. A shop had 65 toys. It sold 21 toys. How many toys are remain? Here we are using another keyword remain. Remain is the keyword of subtraction. Okay kids. Now I am giving 30 seconds time. Time starts now. Is it done kids? Okay. I will tell the answer. Here. First sentence. Number of toys in a shop. How many? 65. Okay. Now how many sold out? 21. Number of toys sold out? 21. Now what they are asking? How many toys are remain? Okay. Number of toys remain in shop. Okay, here minus is the symbol of subtraction. Now I am writing here tens and ones. In the ones place, what are the digits? 5 and 1. Here is the on the top. Big number is there. That's why we are not taking any borrowing. Okay, we can do subtraction. Now 5, keep it in the mind. 5 and open one finger. Okay. What is the 5 before? 4. 5 minus 1? 4. Here in the tens place 6 and 2. Keep it in your mind 6 and open 2 fingers. Okay. 6 before 5. 4. Now how many toys are remain in the shop? 44. Okay. Next. Here is the another story sum with borrowing. Okay. It's a practice time. There were 63 books on a shelf. 37 were taken. How many books are left? Here we are using left and take away, taken. Okay. These both are keywords of subtraction. Okay kids, I am giving 30 seconds time. Time starts now. Is it done kids? Okay. I will tell the answer. Now, what is first one? Number of books in a shelf. How many? 63. And next sentence. How many are take away? Number of books were taken? 37. And what they are asking? How many books are left? Okay. You should calculate. Here, minus is the symbol of subtraction. Okay, we are writing on the top of the numbers, places, tens and ones. Okay, kids. Now, in the ones place, what are the numbers? 3 and 7. Okay, in the top, 3 is the less than 7. That's why 
we can't do subtraction okay we are taking the borrowing in the before number okay we are taking 10 number 10 10 plus 3 13 3 become 13 now 13 minus 7 we can do subtraction now keep it in the mind 13 and open 7 see 7 fingers 13 before 12 11 10 9 8 7 6 5 what is the 13 minus 7? 5. Now here we should cross the 6 and write 5. Here 6 become 5. One number less than. Okay, 5 minus 3. How much? Again keep it in your mind. 5 and open 3 fingers. Okay, what is 5 before? 4. 3, 2, what is the 5 minus 3? 2, okay, how many books are left in your shelf? 25, okay kids, I hope everyone understood this video. Well done, today you did good job, what you learned today? Two digit story sums on subtractions. Okay, keep practice. Here is the smiley ball for you. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please like and subscribe.